I think short term, uh, they will subsidize the general public, especially the uh, weaker people, uh, economically weaker people, uh, to help them uh, subsidize their electricity charge or the communication charge. And in the long run, uh, he need to do the restructuring uh, of the Japanese industry to get out of the uh, pandemic, uh, you know, uh, stagnation. Uh, otherwise, uh, he can raise the interest rate. He has a, a very intimate communication with the BOJ governor, Kuroda-san, but he cannot uh, go follow the same path with other advanced nations, uh, you know, they are raising interest rate. But Japan is struggling because, you know, Japanese uh, businesses are not ready for that. But at the same time, as you have mentioned, it's getting cheaper and cheaper amid of the inf inflation. If we uh, let keep this uh, situation going, Japan will suffer probably stagnation. So he need to uh, quickly do the uh, restructuring uh, of the businesses to get out what, uh, from the stagnation. What, what, what would that restructuring involve? I mean, there, there seems to be talk of a new capitalism in Japan. Uh, mm, what, do, mm. what, what might that consist of? Uh, and how much leeway does he actually have to, to, to actually make anything happen? I mean, restructuring Japan's business culture, it seems like a fairly tough task. So I think once again, he need to do the uh, so-called corporate governance uh, injection into the corporate governance code of Japan and uh, let uh, uh, the shareholders, uh, especially the foreign shareholders, having a bigger voice uh, to let the uh, restructuring of the first uh, uh, the listing company, uh, big companies like uh, uh, Toshiba, Panasonic, and uh, those are need uh, to get restructured restructured by foreign investors. So first, uh, he need to kick off uh, from giving uh, more corporate governance and align the bigger voice uh, for the uh, shareholders, especially the foreign shareholders. And uh, that's the, I think, beginning of the corporate list, uh, big uh, scale corporate list structuring for Japanese companies. Uh, but again, I mean, w within what, what seems to be a fairly coherent and long-running culture of business in Japan. Do you think mm. that the changes amount to uh, potentially a, a problem down the line? So in that case, uh, he has a, a, another card to raise the interest rate. So after this election, he doesn't need to care much about the popularity, so he can raise interest rate in order to counter the uh, depreciation of the yen. At the same time, if you hike the interest rate, it uh, automatically start reflection of the uh, Japanese businesses, weak businesses. But this time, uh, if you raise the interest rate, maybe uh, uh, that's begin uh, from the uh, SMEs. That's quite painful. Maybe uh, raising interest rate at the same time to subsidize to those SMEs to alleviate the pain. So this is another way to make it happen.